We don't play the social game. We are social. Power 98.5. You're listening to Power 98.5, powered by United Angels Dream, your number one resource for public relations, entertainment, and multimedia. Contact them today at unitedangelsdream.com. Prepare yourself. Okay, let's go. Hi, this is Dan Aykroyd. He's progressive. He's beautiful. He's thoughtful. He's intelligent. He's powerful. He's positive. He is Stephen Cuoco on Power 98.5 Satellite Radio. Empowering listeners from the U.S. to the U.K. Live on air with Stephen Cuoco. Tuning in live on air with Stephen Cuoco on Power 98.5. You are listening live to Wavy Wild Boy, and this track is called Angels. He is a United States Marine, CEO of Wavy Media, and he's open for some really, really great talent and big names. DMX and Aaron Knight, just to name a few. Good afternoon, hailing from the New York, New Jersey area, Wavy Wild. What's going on, Steve? How's it going? <laughs> I'm doing great. Good afternoon. Well, good morning. Good morning. Yeah, we we lit. We live. How you doing? How's everything going? Listen, you're here with us today. I want to say thank you for serving our country. Thank you for being here live on air with Stephen Cuoco on Power 98.5. We've got a great audience today. You did a great job getting the word out there, letting everyone know, hey, listen, tune in. Uh you're someone to pay attention to. Yes, sir. And I appreciate the, uh, the the introduction, too. I really appreciate that. So how long have you been? You're not still serving. You've been out for a while, right? Yes, I've been out the military now. Uh, it's 2021, so I got out in 2016. So it's been five years now. Um, I, was, uh, I was a machine gunner and an anti-tank assault missile man. Mm. What has that done for your mental health once you came back to the States or while being here, like, did you struggle with, with anything, PTSD, anxiety, or did you transition very well? I mean, I mean, you know, everybody struggles in their own way, you know, uh, but uh, I think, you know, through the grace of God and everything like that, we all figure out our ways to get through it. I I surround myself with great people that, uh, that helped me definitely like get through different uh, obstacles and, you know, trials and tribulations. But having the opportunity of getting to know you, I definitely know you have a very, very strong mind. And you're one of the fortunate ones that I would say, especially with for myself, with having family and military and law enforcement, uh, you're very structured. You're very solid. It is a rare commodity for someone who is transitioning from military to or back into civilian life. Thank you. Thank you. I try to be as, uh, as, you know, versatile as I possibly can. And at the same token, you know, keep everything on a directive path. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to just 
be out here just doing things just to do it. I definitely have a direction. I definitely have end goals and everything like that, especially with music, you know, and speaking of um, like mental health, I think uh, like the biggest factor in my mental health is my music because just I'm not uh, one of the people that could vocalize too much, like as in like just having a conversation about my mental health. So if you listen to my music, you'll hear some things, you know, um, and, and, and some of the unreleased music too, I'm thinking of that like you'll hear about just like my mental health and you'll hear it like come in in like different parts because I don't ever like want to you know go ahead and make the whole thing about you know a sad situation I'm, I am the wild boy so you know I like to keep everything uplifting and energy filled as in uh the song angels you were just playing you know it is a song about uh you know all the loved ones that we've lost over the years you know especially 2020 hit us all real hard uh, but at the same token, it's about them being lost. But at the same time, we're going to sit there and celebrate their life instead of mourning their loss. How has that inspired you, affected you, and helped you move and push forward with also being a father? Uh, as in what? Like, you, uh, what like, we move? Yeah. Like, what are you doing? Like, how has all of this, like, what's going on? Uh, you know, 2020, we're now in 2021 former, you know, Marine vet, um, what, what inspiration, what encouragement are you leaving for a legacy for yourself and where your children are feeling very inspired by you? Oh, since, since day one, since my kids were young, you know, younger, uh, like babies, they've been listening to my music, uh, singing along to my music. My kids, they, they fill my heart up with so much joy every time they come to me and ask me to hear, all I Want Is You, that's their favorite song. That's featuring my friend uh, Spartacus, another great artist from over here. Um, uh, but yeah, that song, uh, my, my kids, it's pretty much what I do it for. I want to be able to make music my way of life so that I can give them uh, stuff that I never had growing up, you know? Mm-hmm. Your son looks very much like you. He's got your eyes. Yeah, that's my buddy. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody, it's funny you say that. Recently, as he's getting older, people are saying that, no, nah, he doesn't look like me. My daughter's my twin now. Oh, really? <laughs> I still see yeah. it. I still see yeah, it. Yeah, I think I see it. I see it when I look at him. <laughs> I appreciate your Instagram page. Uh, for those that are tuning in, thank you uh, for joining. Oh, I'm going to tell you. A man that should not go unrecognized, and this is why he's here today. And if you don't mind me dropping this gem, this is his first official live radio interview. Yes, sir, definitely. I appreciate everybody tuning in, and I appreciate you, Steven, for having me on here. Oh, absolutely. Mr. Wavy Wild Boy, he is a United States Marine vet. He is the CEO of Wavy Media. He opened for DMX, Aaron Knight, and many other high-rolling talent that is out there. Now that you're doing what you're doing, really full force, full-time now in the music industry, what yeah. are you most proud of, and do you believe that this is the right time, the perfect time for all of this happening for you right now? Um. Uh, that's a two-part question, so I'm going to answer it like that. So and what am I most proud of? I'm most proud of, uh, when it comes to music, I'm, I'm most proud of everything that I've been able to go through and be able to to put it into my music to a point where everybody that's listening, everybody, doesn't matter what age, what race, what culture you're a part of, everybody can relate to my music because it's stuff that I'm really going through, it's stuff that I'm really seeing um, happening. So I'm most proud of myself that um, I'm able to, to to not be a statistic and turn turn something uh, things that are so negative into a positive thing, uh, and I'm proud of like the accompli- accomplishments that I've been able to do. Just you know, just being able to open up for people like DMX, Coily Ray, Aaron Knight, you know, my brother. Um, just you know, working with uh, Rich Dog Loke, you know, that's it's it's awesome because that's you know, he's part of the record label that, that I, I favor the most, you know, Billion Dollar Baby, you know. So it, it's definitely a dope thing for me to be able to just have the opportunities that I have, you know, uh, coming from what I, I, I'm, I'm coming from and transitioning, just like you said, from being in the military to being out here and still being able to 
stay active in my passion. We're going to do a live drop of your new track, Zooted. Tell us about it. Zooted, Zooted. So um, it's very 420 friendly song. Um, for those listening, y'all know what that means. Um, Zooted was my first song that I've actually started engineering myself. Like the first time when I built my studio, uh, I started engineering and I was, you know, I'm, I'm a big baby fan. So I looked up at the baby type beat and I was like, you know what? I'm going to get this. I'm, I'm going to sit in here all night until I figure out how to engineer myself to a sound that I think sounds good for me. And finally, I, you know, I knew that was my energy in that song, Zooted. Um, it's, it's just about having, you know, smoking some good old red, you know, some good old green and <laughs> have, living life good. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Well, I can honestly tell you that uh, unfortunately I'm uh, I have a reaction to a chemical or compound into that. Um, I had many years ago uh, was at a party and secondhand smoke and I ended up in a hospital with tachycardia. So, um, you know, with that being said, for those that can partake there, you know, yeah, I'm surprised you know, I'm, I'm, I'm not, sharing it, but I'm going to yeah, honestly that, say that's, 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 that's wild. Actually, that's, that's really wild that happened. You know, uh, I'm, and I'm sorry to hear about that. You know, I, I promote it more of like, uh, for the medical reason, you know, because that's part of the reason that, that, that keeps me focused on making my music and stuff like that. It helps me with my own mental health uh, issues myself. So that's the reason why I would promote it for anybody. And listen, and I'm glad you share that. And I'm not judging anyone um, who were to to be partaking into that. Um, I'm going to honest. I just felt like sharing and just being transparent that for those um, who do partake in the 420, um, for me, it's I had to stop going into the studio or whatever it may be. Maybe I'm sharing a little bit too much personally about me. But, <laughs> no, you're good. But um. Yeah, like I'm not going to lie when I was younger, but yeah, the doctor told me that uh, we as humans, our bodies can reject anything. You can get, I had tachycardia and you can get tachycardia off of alcohol, coffee, going to the gym, working out, um, stress. Wow. And it's like, yeah, it's like I was, you know, at a party and um, I didn't think anything of it and it just hit me out of the clear blue. So here's my whole point. As once again, I didn't think I was going to go in this area, but I just feel comfortable to just share that little tidbit with you. You um, good, brother, man. You good. <laughs> I used to partake. And uh, when I was really, really young, and I will say that, you know, it was a 90s thing. You know, I'm, I'm Gen X, okay? So um, for that, I'm very much, um, I don't, have a closed mind and I believe with ever, whatever you do, you know, know yourself well and love yourself enough to know to not check out because your life, and I'm not meaning this to you, Mr. Wavy Wild Boy, I'm just saying to yeah. you, anyone, since we're in this, on this topic, that there is a misconception that the younger generation, millennials, you know, uh, even with my generation, that people are checking out with the 420. Um, but there is a great purpose for it, medicinal. Uh, doctors would not be prescribing it if it wasn't. Uh, right. but my only encouragement for those who, who do it um, is that be safe. be safe and that you and your life is so valuable and so important that – we need you here because you are our future, as well as for you, Mr. Wavy Wild Boy. Not saying yes, you sir. do. I know you're very responsible, but we Always. need our young generation not to check out. I don't care if you're doing alcohol. We, You are our future, and what you do is very important. The decisions and choices you make is between you and God, no one else. Everyone can keep their fucking opinions to themselves if they are not asked. I'm only suggesting, since the topic is here, because it is very, very prevalent within the entertainment industry, uh, not just the 420, but even the alcohol, don't check correct. out You're too far. 
don't check out too far because just like you've got too much stuff, too many lives and people that you're going to inspire through your music, through your talent, through your art, through your creativity. And you're a producer too. So What's that? You're a producer as well. So you're doing some I'm, big things. The, so I want to, I want to correct that. I want to correct that because a lot of people, have come to me in the past and asked me, you know, Wavy, I hear you're a producer. I want to um, give a big shout out to my producer, actually. Uh, that's Gemini on the beat. Um, this dude uh, does, you know, amazing work for me. I literally hum stuff through the phone to this dude, and he turns it into the music y'all hear now. Mm. Um, I'm not a producer. I'm an artist, and I'm also an engineer. Uh, I'm an audio engineer. So I engineer my music as well. Um, but I don't ever, you know, take away from the the studios that, that molded me. And, and you're still going to be hearing music from other studios that I've worked with. Shout out Drumline Studio. Shout out The Retreat. Shout out uh, Goon over there at the Big Bank Vault. You know, you'll hear def you'll definitely hear a lot of that stuff, you know. Um, but yeah, I am not a producer myself, but I am going to be learning how to produce music as well. So, so I just put that out there in the ether to the Angels aliens god the universe that's right go. it's gonna happen it's gonna happen we're gonna, man we gonna manifest that we're gonna manifest that <laughs> it just it just we just did the moment you proclaim something it is so definitely um thank you everyone for joining mr wavy wild boy we are now going to go into a live drop on his new hit single zooted out on all platforms right now. Go get that, y'all. Hear me? Mm hmm. And you're gonna find out right now. We're gonna go. We're gonna go live. Let's let's go. It. Let's bring it. Hits ain't getting no sleep till the morning. Faded off cookies, I'm zooted and booted. I'm lifted straight while and I jig while recording. My baby be loving my music. She sing all the lyrics. She making me proud. I adore her. Don't get it twisted. I'm wildin'. You push me. I'm out for the killing and slaughter. I'm making this music so one day I'll come up and then I'ma get me a Grammy. I want it. Etch it in stone for the culture. I post on my Instagram page so I stun it. They thought I was playing. I caught me a body and nobody knew till they found him. Don't play with my youth cause them young boys be shooting at everything that's all around them. Guess I'm smoking. No sonic, no pirates in order to guess we chief and exotic. Yeah. The police behind me, now I'm on the run from the jakes. I don't fuck with narcotics. Hey, yeah. look at me, fuck off me. I don't have time for the fuckery. I just be counting bread, fuck a hoes in the crib, living life ever so comfortably. Yeah. Nah, I really hey. do that shit though. Hey. Like, I really live that yeah. life though. Like, hey. like I really hey. do that hey. shit. Hey. Second verse booming, started a movement. Huh? Bad bitches ain't counting up blue strip. Making a mess in the crib, I was shooting you. Yeah. Plus, my gangs just know that I'm booming. I'm with all this. She love me, we left for your text. She gave me a towel to wipe up the mess. Yeah. It's just clear that I'm better. Facts. Every time that I'm in it, she wetter and wetter. Don't Splash. piss me off, make me get up. Huh? If I tell you to meet, I ain't bringing no setup. I'ma nah. take all that money, that cheddar. Jeez. Then I'm taking your picture, you better not tag me in nothing. I'm playing, I'm fed up. Good. Cross the line, I'ma flip it, you about to get wet up. I be up late night making these hits, ain't getting no sleep till the morning. Faded yeah. off cookies, I'm zooted and booted. I'm lifting straight while and I jig while recording. My baby, she loving my music, she sing all the lyrics, she making me proud of her. Said I'm wild you push me, I'm out for the killing the slaughter. Hey, I like that. Hey, let's go. <laughs> let's go. It's crazy, yo. This whole thing is crazy to me. Just just seeing the process of that being made, just thinking back on the process of that being made to know that it's on a radio station, satellite satellite radio station right now is is, is amazing. It's a, it's a really crazy feeling. I'm going to close out by playing Angels. And what I would like for you to do, Wavy Wild Boy, is what would be the best advice you would have for someone who's looking to be a breakout artist, an upcoming artist? What's your advice? Stay consistent. Don't ever give up. Uh, the the best thing that I can say is too. Right when 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 things are getting like the hardest for you, that's when it's gonna get easier. Essentially, 
but it's going to get harder before it gets easy. Any shout outs you want to give? Yeah, definitely want to give big shout outs to Royal Cuts um, Barbershop in Newburgh, New York. That's located in the Newburgh Mall. I want to give a shout out to Hudson Valley Exotics in Poughkeepsie, New York. I want to give big shout outs to my guy Spartacus. Big shout outs to my guy Chris Johnson. Uh, everybody in the 845, yo. Uh, oh, definitely big shout out to my business partner, Ben J, man. Yo, y'all follow him on Instagram too, yo. <laughs> shout out to Ben. Thank you, bro. I- big shout out to Ben. <laughs> <laughs> I want to thank you for joining us today live on air with Stephen Cuoco on Power 98.5. And I want to thank everyone for tuning in. This artist, Mr. Wavy Boy, he's, he's bigger than that. The heart and spirit, the opportunity that I've had in getting to know him and to build rapport and a friendship with him has been absolutely remarkable. And... I want to thank everyone and including the younger generation, millennials, Gen Z, emerging generations. All of you are worthy. Don't let what's happening in the world affect you. You matter. As I shared earlier, you know, relax, be at peace, be comfortable with who you are and what you're doing and what's happening in life. But at the same time, Remember not to don't check out. Don't check oh, out. Oh no, the no, I've got the you. call. The call failed. Oh, I know. I, it did. I, you're back on live, my friend. I'm, I'm still, we still live on the air. We're still live. Ah, uh, cool. Yeah, because I wasn't done giving my shout outs real quick. I, I wanted to give a shout out to you, definitely, Steve, for reaching out to me. And big shout out, huge, the biggest shout out ever to my guy Loco Ninja, yo, know, for definitely doing that link up right there. That's my guy right there. Shout out to him. Big shout out to him. <laughs> Yeah, uh, hey, uh, didn't you love, love technology? You you went off. You you're back on. That's right. That's right. Um, as I was saying, you're valuable. You've got, just like what Mister Wavy Wild Boy is doing. You've got a voice. You've got a message, and we all want to hear it. And this is why I really encourage everyone: don't let life, don't let what's happening in the world right now. And honestly, you know, for the more more mature community, what they call boomers and stuff like that, you've done the best that you could do. And the way of business worked back then. But we are in a new time, a new era. We are, uh, you know, millennials, Gen Z, they all are creating, just like what Wavy Wild Boy is doing, a new way of business, a new way of relationships, a new way of bridging communication and creativity and community all together. Let talent like Wavy Wild Boy succeed and advance in this world. They don't need some bullshit, you know, high record label. Because we all know that you're going to want to steal and take over their masters and then try to sell it back to them once they reach a certain status. Be an ally and advocate for them. Help and support them. Don't look at them as a thing or a property or real estate. And with that, I was going to close out, but I'm so inspired by you. And Yeah, appreciate that. What we've, what we've built together in our friendship I'm going to go ahead and do another live track. I haven't done this before. I haven't gone into a closing point and then come back up, but it's worth it. And for some reason, my heart is telling me to play Can't Hang. Do you want to that's show mad. That's wild. Now, there's, there's got to be some kind of wild spirits out there or some kind of like... <laughs> uh, uh, connected to the universe or something like that. That's the, off the album Still Chasing Dreams featuring my guy Remy Hendrix, bro. Oh my God, that's funny. That is my favorite record off the album produced also by Goon of Big Bang Vault Studios. Can't hang. All right, we're going to That's go. my favorite record. Well, we're, we've got to keep you on a little bit longer. You're worth it, as I said before. This is what we are supposed to do in the industry. You know, boomers, 
it's it, you know gen x i'm of the gen x generation we are supposed to be allies for you guys we are to 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 help set the stage and to be able to present you in a non bullshit you know way organic without, way organic thank you with, <laughs> with good intentions this is why we as gen x boomers please go retire because it's now our turn our generation to step forward also why does everybody have to be close to retirement age with if you're in politics uh let's get more gen x in there let's get millennials in there they're a smart generation they're out doing you guys your corporations are closing the fuck down (laughs) we got to get a new way what that's right. We're getting a new wave. We're going to get a new wave, too. That's a fact. We're going to get a lot of new wave. Every Wednesday, I'm dropping new music for them, too. Mm-hmm. Here we go. Can't hang. Don't play with you Getting jiggy, that's the way we move Snapping pictures, catch some mangoes too And if you brought me, I can't hang with you, no I ain't even gonna play with you Getting jiggy, that's the way we move Snapping pictures, catch some mangoes too And if you brought me, I can't hang with you, no Getting jiggy in the parking lot You know I'm about that action You ain't around me if you talk a lot Tread lightly, you ain't shitting and get off the pot Pop a doc, put that overtime and I ain't on the clock Damn, I just flex for the gram You a bum, need a fix, go and flex for a gram Life's a beach, I'm the wave, I came up from the sand Now I'm on top and I can't stop, so I just stick to the plan Yes, no flex zone, hating on my X zone On my Drake shit, OB to the X zone Alpha blood, I'm just wondering who's next Why you out here breaking hearts, I'm just out here breaking neck bones I don't think you wanna play with me My life is tough to spend the day with me If you ain't bad it, mommy say la vie Fly as I am, it's plain to see I ain't even gonna play with you Getting jiggy, that's the way we move Snapping pictures, catch some mangoes too And if you brought me, I can't hang with you, no I ain't even gonna play with you Getting jiggy, that's the way we move R-E-N-Y, Hendrix in this bitch, thrilling myself, these hoes be like, he think he the shit, tell the judge I'm on brown, yup, hit me what I sip, did I drink a gallon right after court, I plead the fifth, shit, my partner got the bins, I'ma cop the Bentley, whiter than cocaine, damn a nigga looking spiffy, you damn skippy, they say they need tan, and it's nothing to get him that Peter Pan in a jiffy, dig me, lately all I been hearing is gimme but you can't get a dime let alone a penny so i ain't even finna play with you after you come leave i can't stay with you these girls will bleed you dry if you let them the view free but they charge for the box like spectrum haters i ain't got shit to say to you never heard of you niggas keep banging fool I ain't even gon' play with you Getting jiggy, that's the way we move Snapping pictures, catch some mangoes too And if you brought me, I can't hang with you, no I ain't even gon' play with you Getting jiggy, that's the way we move Snapping pictures, catch some mangoes too And if you brought me, I can't hang with you, no I'm really glad I played that. Definitely. That was one of my favorite records. Let's go. Big shout out my guy, Remy Hendrix, for jumping on that record. Jumping on my album for me, too. He just dropped another album, too, for uh, Off Papers, too, by the way. That shit's out now, too. Did he? We're actually, here's another uh, golden point to touch upon. What new track do you have coming out or what new project? Wow, yeah, I'm glad you asked that. I was wondering if that was uh, getting skipped over. We got 96 days until they figure that out, you know what I'm saying? Um, if if people have been paying attention to my posts and everything like that, every now and then I've been giving them a little countdown. Mm. So you gotta, they got to go on my, my Instagram page um, and check the countdown, find out when that album is going to be dropping. 
um i kind of put it like a hidden message in there so y'all gotta go follow me on instagram at wavy wild boy or my media page at wavy media 845 and y'all find the hidden message in there when the album's dropping Jeez. it's like but, treasure hunt time that's right that's right it is treasure <laughs> hunt, you know what I'm saying? and while you're there don't just go looking you know what i'm saying just don't go looking actually click that follow button you're gonna actually hear all the new drops i'm dropping singles every wednesday every now and then i'm dropping freestyles every wednesday you you might get a video oh um uh, somewhere in there look at that just dropping spilling the beans on you real quick I appreciate it. Well, definitely keep me posted when a new track is released. I'll share, uh, you know, my opinion, let you know if we should get you back on because it's that good for a live drop of it. And yeah, that's it. I appreciate you. Oh, and the Zooted remix is dropping soon, too, as well, too. Uh, Zooted, uh, the remix uh, featuring Rich Dunk Lope dropping soon, too. As uh, you and I talked I, as you can tell, I keep it very organic and let let it unfold the way it's meant to. Um, even for myself, I'm allowing myself as much as it kind of makes me uncomfortable to be a lot more transparent in a world with people because I'm so used to working and helping people to do their best and be their best that uh, I'm really not accustomed to be sharing information about me or personal information but i am breaking that through every sledgehamming thing that i can do to get through to that uncomfortability because like you mr wavy wild boy god has been telling me it's time to step forward because we have a lot to talk about we have a lot to share and people are ready to listen and we've got to find each other who are very like-minded right now Yes, definitely. I'm you know you know how I rock, Steve, man. You know I, I'm all game for everything. Whatever it needs to get done, it's gonna get done ten times over, ten times better than you expect it to. Well, as you know, I do not pre plan my questions. Is there anything else you wanna give a drop, give a tidbit on, any inside info before we close? Angels video dropping soon, Zooty remix dropping soon, album comes coming soon. Follow me on Instagram at Wavy Wild Boy, W A V Y Wild Boy, or Wavy Media, W A V Y Media 845. Thank you. Appreciate you again, Steve. Thank you. Hold the line. Thank you, everyone, for joining Wavy Wild Boy live on air with Stephen Quilco on Power 98.5. He gave you all the gems, all the drops. Get there. Spotify, Apple Music. I've got nothing else to say because it's already been said. Friend us on your socials and let's connect.